Hello, welcome back guys. Today we are talking about how to book flights using Google Flights. So to start with, let us open our browser and then type for google.com here in the web address. All right. So let's just click this Google and then search for Google Flights. All right. Okay. So once you're done in searching for Google Flights website, okay, you can now select here your ticket, whether it is a round trip, one way or multi-way. So let's say, for example, you want to get a ticket of a round trip. So just click round trip and at the right part of here, you can select your travel class also. You can select whether it is economy, premium economy, business or first. So let's say, for example, we want an economy travel. So after that one, guys, you can now set our place of region. Let's say, for example, our place of origin is General Santa City Airport. So just click this one and where to? Where is the destination? So let's say, for example, Mactan Cebu International Airport. Just click this one. And after that one, guys, after setting up your place of origin and destination, you can now check your airfare. Okay, so just click this calendar. And of course, don't forget to set up your date. So what is the date? What is your preferred date of flight? Let's say, for example, February 11. I want to fly from February 11. And I want the return date will be on February 15. So once I've done in selecting the date, I'll just click this down over here. And now I can now select the time of my departing flights okay there is 8 15 4 25 8 15 to 5 20 okay so let's say for example i'm just going to select this one okay 11 a.m the cheaper one and of course i have to select also the returning flights the date and of course the time so i can now select here Okay, I want this one, 11.30 a.m. to 12.40 p.m., like that. So, once I've done in selecting this, guys, I can now book my, with my prefer um, airlines. This one, book with Cebu Pacific. So, continue. Click continue. Alright. So, once we're done in selecting our origin, our date of flight and of course the time we can now um, redirect it to the Cebu Pacific website so of course guys you can also log in using your email or your password and of course you can continue as a guest so let us click this one continue as a guest now we can type here our personal information let's say for example Marie this is just an example. This is not my true name. Marie Collins. Okay. So let's type Marie Collins date of birth. Let's say for example, 8 August 8, 1990. Okay, 1997. All right. So please select national like Philippines. And then, of course, if you are a PWD or person with disability, just click this box. But if you're not, then just leave it alone. Okay, just leave it blank, should I say. Does this passenger require special assistance? Click, um, click this yes if you are and no if you are not. And of course, don't forget to click this small box to confirm that I have read and understood and agreed to the updated Cebu Pacific privacy policy, which provides additional information on how my personal information is used. So once you check, once you check it, click continue. Okay. So, all right. Don't forget this one also, by the way. And of course, Oh, we forgot. Do not forget to select whether you are a Mr. or Miss. So let's click Miss. All right. So let's wait for a moment. 
Okay, once you're done in filling out your information, just select, okay, this one. You can save seat selector, save fun shop, save meals. You can add this one where you are going to fly it, okay? But if you don't want to have this additional, just save all and proceed, okay? All right. Do you want to order now? No. Okay. Do you have any add-ons? Are you sure you want to continue? Yes. All right. So after this one, guys, you can now have or see your booking summary. All right. This one. Booking total is 4,100, uh, 4,012 pesos and 24 centavo. Just click it and then continue. So after this one, guys, how would you like to pay? You are now going to pay to fully book your, your ticket. So all you have to do is just click this Miss or Mr. And then, of course, your additional information. And after that one, how would you like to pay? You're going to pay it through a credit card, PayPal, Alipay, payment centers, and travel fan. And then also, once you've done in selecting this one, guys, Click this small box here and submit though. And of course, just follow all this, the remaining steps to fully, um, to fully, what do you call this one? To fully book your ticket. So there you go. This is on how to book your flights using Google Flights. So if you know, if you want to know on how to book flights using Google Flights, that's the easiest way I know. And if you know another way on how to book flights using Google Flights, just leave a comment below and be sure to subscribe. Bye, guys!